Hi, this is Jill Viverka, and today I wanted to talk a little bit about investing in yourself. That's something that you may not think about very often, and uh, it's really important, especially when you're starting a business of your own. It's a good time when you're young, or now, uh, to invest your time in yourself. And investing time means learning what you're going to enjoy, learn what you're good at, and what will the world pay you to do at this point in your life. Try to wander through life doing jobs you don't like and living paycheck to paycheck is kind of disrespectful to yourself. And uh, so you need to spend time and figure out what you want and what you can do well and use it. Another way to invest in yourself is to invest your time getting an education. And yeah, you've maybe gone through college and, and uh, taken other courses, but you really need to invest your, in yourself as far as your skills and talents go and keep up with new ideas, look at innovative ways to complete tasks uh, to be paid for. And that's what I did when I was looking at online marketing. I discovered there were many avenues of training and found a good one and used it. Um, you might want to create an investment fund. Fund. Now this means that you're going to be earning some money and you need to be prepared to do that. Uh, you might want to have money set aside that you can reinvest into your business or actually invest it like in stocks and bonds and uh, have money make money for you if you get to be so successful. So that's something that you need to do that's wise to do if you haven't thought about it already. Uh, you just need to have a place to save some money so that you have money at your disposal to help your business grow. Learn how to raise money. Now that's an interesting interesting thought. I, I hadn't really considered that before. But if you know how to help raise money for an uh, organization or for your own uh, goals and your own deals, that's, very, that's a very good skill to have. And uh, you'll go far using knowing how to get money uh, that way. And you need to follow the rules though. There are rules about raising money for organizations, various organizations that you really do need to follow so you don't get yourself in trouble. But uh, that's, those are good skills to learn. Connecting with people, working with people, convincing them to donate. That's really good. You can use those, those skills in your own business as well. And uh, finally, start a business. That's what we're talking about here. Uh, second stream of income. That's, that's my focus for you, uh, is to share what I'm doing and how I do it uh, in order to help you gain financially. And uh, most self-made millionaires uh, get there by starting their own business. And you can start your own business. You don't have to have your own products to sell. You can be an affiliate and market the products of another company. But that is your business. You are a part of their business, but it's your chunk of their business. Um, you don't need a new idea to start your own business because if you're an affiliate, you can just kind of get on the train and help promote products that are already in existence. Um, and you often don't need to have your own money. There are undiscovered investors among us who will easily donate $25,000 or $100,000 to starting business owners and starting businesses if it's something that they feel they can believe in. So look for them. You can find money out there to start a business. There's no doubt about it. So I got training and I started my own business online uh, as an affiliate and am, I have this as my second stream of income along with my retirement income being a teacher and, um, and I'm making good commissions now and, and really enjoying that success and I'm passing it forward to you. Um, on this page someplace is a link and it'll say jillviverka.com forward slash call. And that's a link to a page uh, that you can fill out to give me some information about yourself um, and how I can connect with you and contact you. I would like to be the one who opens a door for financial success for you and financial comfort in your retirement. So uh, use that form and fill it out and I will get it. And uh, we will be able to connect that way and schedule a time to talk. Let's talk soon.